underscoring and overscoring text in single line text. So if we go to our home tab and we go to single line text, or if we go to annotate and we go to single line text, when we put single line text in and we start our start point, we select our height, I'll say eighth inch and a rotation of zero. I want to underscore text. So in order to underscore text, I have to do control code, which is a percent percent. The code for underscoring is U. When I type in the U, anything will be underscored. So I'll say underscore text. So, and I'll hit enter, enter to finish the command. So it draws a line right underneath the text. So if I do that again, I'll come in and pick my start point and my height and zero with the cap locks this time. And I'll say this is underscore and the underscore. And you'll notice that it's not being underlined, but when I come up here and I do a percent percent, I type in U, it underlines it. And it'll just keep on underlining until I'm done with the command. Now, how you get it to stop is you, you put in the beginning percent percent u, so I'll go percent percent u, whoop, sorry, percent percent u, and I'll say under line, and now to stop it, I'll put another percent percent u in. So I'll do percent percent u, and I'll say now no more underline. And so to finish, I can hit enter, enter. So to start the underlying, I do percent percent %u. To finish the underlying, I do percent percent %u. Now, let's talk about overscore. And overscore is when we put a line above the text. So I'm going to come over here, start my start point, and I'll do percent percent %o for overscore. And I'll say overscore. I'll hit enter, enter, and you can see that it put overscore there. It'll just keep right on drawing the line above it until, until you're done with the command. If you want to stop, you have to hit uh, percent percent %o, and it'll stop the overscores, just like we did with the underline. Now, this works really good for when you want to underline words, because it makes a line that's connected to it, it's perfectly parallel with the line. It's the same length. It can't be separated. So we use this a lot for things that are like first floor plan. Um, and we'll use it for section AA, things like that. So I'll say something like uh, section AA. If I wanted that underline, I just do a, you know, a percent percent U and bang, and it's done. And so um, we tend to use that in various like titles and uh, detailed names and things of that nature. So underscoring and overscoring text uses the control code sequence of U and O.